وکیل یار دم لڑی ما کے اینڈ اٹ واز سیڈ او ارتھ یو سوالو بیک یور واٹر ویا سما وکلی ہیلو اسکائی او ہیون ود آل یور واٹر وغید الماء اینڈ واٹر سب سائڈڈ وقضی الامر اینڈ دی ہول میٹر واز سیٹلڈ اینڈ ڈیسائیڈڈ مستمت علی الجودی اینڈ دی آرک سٹیڈ کیم ٹو اے ریسٹ آن جودی دس جودی از اے پیک امنگ دی ارارات رینج آف ماؤنٹین اینڈ دس از این ایریا وچ از ایبسولیوٹلی ان بٹوین جوائننگ لی ویئر دیز تھری کنٹریز آر میٹنگ ٹرکی رشیا آرمینیا اینڈ اٹ از اے ویری ڈیفیکلٹ پلیس ٹو گو یو نو ٹو ریچ دی ٹاپ سو وین ایور یو نو مسلمس ہیو سم اتھارٹی اینڈ دے کین ڈو اٹ اینڈ دے ہیو دی مینس دے شوڈ سینڈ دس ایکسپیڈیشن بیکاز قرآن سیز ان مینی پلیسز اللہ سبحانہ و تعالیٰ ہیز کیپٹ اٹ اینڈ اٹ ول اپیئر اینڈ پیپل ول نو دیٹ دس از دی آرک آف نو علیہ صلاۃ وسلام وکیل آباد بود القوم غالمین سیڈ اینڈ پروکلیم ڈن اوے ود دی ایول ڈوئنگ پیپل دے ہیو بین فینشڈ بود القوم غالمین ونا دا نوح رب ناؤ نوح کالڈ آؤٹ ٹو ہز لارڈ فقاد رب ان ابنی میں نہلی اینڈ ہی سیٹ او مائی لارڈ مائی سن وارس فرام ممس مائی فیملی in nawad al haq and your promise is true you promised you will save my family wan tahkamul hakimin and you are the best judge of all the judges now the way it's a complaint but the way how this complaint is being presented to the lord yanada anu rabbahu qala rabbi in nabni min ahli wa in nawad al haq وان تحکم الحاکم یو گوڈ سے مائی مائی سن واز ڈسٹرائڈ اینڈ ڈراؤنڈ یو ہیڈ پرامس می دیٹ مائی فیملی ول ریمین سیف کالا یا نو ہو ان نہ از ویری امپارٹنٹ پلیس آف قرآن ایون یو نو اے بانس مین لائک نو ہیونگ سرڈ اللہ فار نیئرلی اے تھاؤزینڈ ایئرس اسٹل ہیز اے بانس مین الرب رب و ان تنزل و العبد و عبد و ان ترقا بانس مین ریمین اے بانس مین ہی مائٹ اسین ٹو دی سیونتھ ہیون ایز محمد اسینڈ صلی اللہ علیہ وسلم ان دی نائٹ آف اسینشن اینڈ دی لارڈ ریمینس دی لارڈ آل دو ہی مے کم ڈاؤن ٹو دی لوئسٹ لوئسٹ ہیون دی ڈفرنس آف لارڈ اینڈ بانس مین ریمینس ایز سچ جسٹ لک thousand years hardest labor calling people bearing all the hardships people laughing mocking at him but here a slight you know you may say an appeal a request a humble request but it had an you know a, a sort of a, what we should say protest تکون <laughs> The same words appeared for Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam surah al-an'am. Don't be from among jahileen. If you can, فَإِنْ كَانَ كَبْرُوا عَلَيْكَ عِرَادُهُمْ فَإِنْ اسْتَتَعْتَ أَنْ تَبْتَغِيَ نَفَقًا فِي الْأَرْضِ أَوْ سُلَّمًا فِي الْأَرْضِ سَمَاءِ فَتَعْتْ يَوْمِ مِنْ آيَا If, you know, the matter has become unbearable for you, if you can, you know, if you can dig a tunnel in the land or you can have a ladder into the sky and bring them a, a, a miracle go and have it who is being addressed here 
انہو عمل غیر صالح فلا تسل نما لیس لک بھی علم ڈونٹ آس می فار وچ یو ہیو نو نالج ان دی آئز کان تکون من الجاہلین آئی ایڈمانش یو لیس یو شوڈ بیکم ون آف دی اگنورنس قال رب انی اعوذ بکان اسلک ما لیس لی بھی علم امیجیٹلی حضرت نو علیہ السلام ریپلائیڈ او مائی لارڈ آئی ٹیک ریفیوج ان دی لیسٹ I should ask from you about which I have no knowledge. Why la taqfirli wa tarhamni akum min al-khasirin. And if you don't forgive me and you don't show mercy to me, I will become one of the losers. The same words which Hazrat Adam Hawa, they uttered. Rabbana zulamna anfusana wa illam taqfir lana wa tarhamna la nakunanna min al-khasirin. We read it in Surah Al-Araf. قيل يا نوح بسلام منا وبركات عليك it was said and proclaimed قيل it was said some angel might have proclaimed يا نوح بسلام منا او نو now you get down from this ark with peace from us سلام منا وبركات and blessings from us عليك on you وعلى امم من من معك And all the nations and communities who will emerge from those who are with you in the ark. These words are very important. O mamin, mim man mark. The communities and nations, the progenies of those who are with you in the ark. Wa umamun sanumatiyohum. And there are going to be nations. whom we shall give some worldly things some provisions of the, this world summa yamassuhum min azabun alim and then a very painful torment is going to come to them now this refers to ad they were also from the progeny of hazrat isam alayhi salatu wassalam then again to samud he was also from the progeny of from ad and so on and even the chaldean empire you know that was in in iraq that was also from sam So all these, you know, prophets who are mentioned in Quran, they are actually all progeny of Sam, Semitic races. Whether they are, you know, the Jews or they are the Arabs, they were the uh, Chaldeans or all the Phoenicians, etc., etc. All people who lived in in Syria, in Iraq, in the Arabian Peninsula, all these people, and from there actually, at um, at you know different times. people came out and invaded at the time of hazrat yusuf alaihi salam the king in egypt was from this very arabian peninsula he was not firaun that is why in the surah surah yusuf we don't find the word firaun malik qal al malik they were actually the hyksos kings they call in the history of egypt these this was not a dynasty of firauna but it was another dynasty of a people who had come come from the arabian peninsula invaded egypt and they had established their rule over there so this this was the, so, so to say a reservoir of human potential wa umamun sanmatuhum summa yamassuhum min adabun alim tilka min nambai al ghayb nuhiha ilayk this is the concluding ayah of this discourse these are from the news of the unseen which we are revealing to you o muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam ma kunta ta'lamuha anta wala qaumuka you didn't know them neither you yourself nor your nation people of ad were known to these arabs people of hud ad because they dwelt in the peninsula in the southern part of the peninsula which is the worst type of deserts today the worst desert in the world and samud this nation was also and uh, inhabiting the arabian peninsula the 
northern western you know corner of arabian peninsula just near the gulf of aqaba so these people then you know along the right on the eastern coast of aqaba there were the people who were to, to whom were sent hazrat shuaib alayhi salatu wasalam then you know around the coast of the dead sea there, there were situated the cities of sodom and gomorrah so there was sent hazrat lut alayhi salam so all these nations they were known to these people but because the nation of lut alayhi salatu wasalam lived high up to in the north in that area which is today called kurdistan part of it in is in turkey part of it is in iraq part of it is in iran and some of it is in armenia so this was higher up so arab the arabs you know they didn't know the history of hazrat nuh alayhi salam so that is why allah subhanahu wa taala is saying tilka min anba'il ghaib nuhiha ilaik ma kunta ta'lamuha anta wa la qawmuka min qabl hadha you didn't know them nor yourself nor your nation before this fasbir so oh muhammad have patience persevere because the result will be the same you will be helped you will be delivered you and people who have come to believe in you we shall help them our help shall come to them in the laqibat al muttaqin and the happy end are for those who fear allah who are god conscious who regard allah who believe in him who love him and who spend everything for his pleasure barakallahu li wa lakum fil qur'an al azim wa nafa'ni wa iyyakum bil ayati wa zikri al hakim